What's up, Planeswalkers? Theric6 back with some more Magic the Gathering Arena. And today, we're going to be doing another viewer uh, suggested deck. Excuse me. Um, we're doing some Blue Green Ramp with Tatiova. Now, at first, I was really fretting about how I'd be able to make this deck, you know, compete with the top tier. And then I remembered Wizards changed it so that the deck power level plays a role in who you're matched up against. So we're probably still going to be able to get good games, even though I'm not really sure about how strong this deck will be. Um, so the person who suggested this, um, they were awesome. They donated to the channel. Um, and, you know, I, I, I let them know. I was like, hey, would you like me to do any decks? And he was like, blue, green ramp with some counter spells. So I was like, you know what? Let's do it. Tatiova is a really cool card. Um, and blue, green allows us to play some some pretty cool planeswalkers, uh, Nissa and uh, Nissa. <laughs> I'm not I'm not playing a uh, mono blue Tezzeret because uh, that card doesn't work, and I don't have any of the new uh, planeswalker Vivian Reed because I don't actually think she's very good. But let's jump into the the deck tech as it were. Um, we're running four land elves, good old uh, good old turn one mana dork. We're running two broken bonds. Now I was really wondering whether or not this card is good. I saw it run around in a couple lists, and I think it I think there are enough. Artifacts and enchantments running around. That this card is fine main decked as two. It also ramps us, which is fantastic. Uh, I'm running one, uh, me, one compass and one treasure map. Um, they're kind of interchangeable. Um, compass gets you land, so you can keep rocking the lands, and treasure map makes it so you don't constantly run out of lands. Treasure map is anti flood. Thematic compass is a uh, anti you know mana screw. So. Three Disallowed because those are the best counterspells, and three Supreme Wills because they are a good counterspell that we are able to use uh, as uh, a card selection uh, if we don't need the counterspell. We're running a split of three Gift of Paradise and three Girl from the Ashes. Girl from the Ashes is better if we have a Tatsiova out and we need lands. Gift of Paradise is great when we are trying to not die against aggro. <laughs> we're running two Spring to Mine. Um, this is not as good on the spring side as Grow to Ashes has potential to be. Um, however, we do have the ability to draw cards later on in the game, so that's why we're running those. Three Glimmer of Genius, because again, I think that we, if we don't have Tatiova, we might run out of cards, and we don't want to run out of cards. So, I like Glimmer of Genius here. Um, four, maybe, or three is maybe too many, um, but eh. Two Karn, um, look, Karn's a good card, alright? <laughs> you can't blame me for playing a card that's just so stupidly strong as Karn is, so I'm playing Karn. I'm running one Nissa because I only own one, and I'm I'm going to need those Mythic Wear wild cards that you see for the deck that people want me to play. So <laughs> right now it's just one Nissa. Um three Tatiovas, the essentially namesake of the deck. Um I mean this card is just insane, right? Like it 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 draws you a card, great against control. Uh it gains you a life, great against aggro. Unfortunately, it is a five minute three three, so the body isn't great against aggro the turn you play it. It's kind of uh, it's kind of more like a six drop because I think you're gonna want to get value out of it immediately, but I'm not entirely sure. Um, but you know, if if the if the card sticks around, you'll uh, you'll do a pretty good job. And we can we have ramp. We can theoretically get this out earlier. One river rebuke, um, a stopgap against uh, aggro. This is kind of our high end here. Um, one carnage tyrant because uh, we hate control. Go away. One maltani, another anti control card. Also relatively good against um, aggro because it. Or, I should say mid-range, just because it keeps coming back. Um, and we are able to return lands to our hand in order to replay them with Tatiova, which is a fantastic synergy. Also has reach, which is very important for dealing with stupid flyers. One Nezahal, uh, another anti-control card. Just a, a nice a nice top end that we will want. And uh, one Nissa. This card is very um, uh, versatile. We can put it down at different points in the, in the curve, and we are able to benefit essentially at any point. And then our mana base is kind of meh. We do want to make sure we have a lot of uh, basic lands just because we're going to be getting a lot of them. A Memorial to Genius to draw cards if we need it. Um, a Memorial to Unity to try and find Tatiova if we need it. One Botanical Sanctum, one Hinterland Harbor. These should probably be higher just obviously because they're better uh, lands than Woodland Stream, which is what we were running um, instead. One Arch. Um, we are running a ramp deck, so uh, we'll probably be able to get a ton of land permanence, so we should have the City's Blessing pretty quickly, um, and Arch Varaska will help us against control. Um, Evolving Wild is great with Tatiova because it's two triggers. We get one from the initial Evolving Wild and then another from the land that we fetch with it. And Field of Ruin, similarly, um, is two triggers because we get it when we play it, and then when we sack it to destroy one of our opponent's stupid lands, we can get it back. 
Um, there are some cards that I was potentially going to run. I'm not going to go, well, also cards that I wasn't sure how many I should run. Um, I'm not going to go through all of them. But uh, these cards were things that I was thinking about running. So um, if you have these and not something else that I'm running, uh, feel free to slot those in instead. And with that, let us get into free play. Let's get into the game. And as you could probably sell by my uh, my lack of uh, quest completion, I've been out all day long. That's why I, I just had a burst of me uh, replying to comments just now. So that's that's what that was. I have some, uh, some good channel-y news going up against Mike Lay 2000. I will never change my avatar until a better avatar is present. Like Nicol Bolas. <laughs> we are going first. Cool, cool. We have a turn one Lenore Elves into a turn two Spring, so this is a good keep. And let's see what my opponent's doing. Pull a mulligan to six. Do they mull to five? They do not, and they keep it on top. Okay. Turn one elf is cool. So, let's see. Ah, it's it's aggro. Okay. So I'm not I'm not gonna block that. Sure, that's fine. Let's go ahead and spring. Let's get an island. The following turn we might need to block, not entirely sure. But the uh, the voting is in. White, black, angels, or mono white. Um, I'm probably going to go uh, end up with mono white. Um, that has one, so that will be the first deck I work towards. Um, after that, it'll be uh, the Jund Aristocrats deck. Uh, followed by Enchantment Muldratha. And then the Bolas Midrange Module Combo and Mill have all tied. Um, hmm. I think I'll minus two Karn. Um, so those those I will play a little bit more by ear based on the cards that I have at the time I finish uh, the Enchantment Muldratha. Yeah, so that's, that's what that order will be. Um, additionally, um, I'm going to start adding what is in the current rotation. Oh, I hate Goblin Chain Whirler so much. I hate that card so much. Apologies for the frame rate. Wow, I wonder what card I'm gonna get. Crap. So this this is kind of the thing that I was talking about, um, and with the the deck, the deck power, right? Like this is probably just like a bunch of uh, cards that are only played in mono red. So like their their technical power isn't very high, so the deck isn't rated very high, and they can just add powerhouse cards like Goblin Chain Whirler, and run people over. I do have a disallow. And I can theoretically Rivers Rebuke next turn. But I'm going to be at 6. Jeez. What are you doing? Whatever. Um I'm going to I'm going to be putting uh, what's in the current rotation in my uh, descriptions now. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and counter that. Yeah, it's unfortunate. I'm pretty sure I'm just like dead. I can get back Tatiova and get two triggers off of it. Sure. I mean, they didn't respect Karn, so I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm not just straight dead. But like, he has the thing is, he can use Bromat Courier. I don't think he should use it now. It looks like he's going to, but I don't think he needs to. Yeah, he he could have waited. Sure. And I mean, I could have waited to counterspell that, but like, I didn't want to die. Um, so we get back Tatiova. Play Tatiova. Okay. 
sec this for you. Blue source. Go to five. And then probably die anyway. Uh, I probably misplayed there. Yeah, it's probably a misplay. I don't know. I'm probably just dead anyway. <laughs> uh, whatever. Um, and I think one of the decks that I'm going to be playing um, while I am, you know, unable to... Let's see, one, two... I have to double these. It's so... I mean, it's dangerous going down no matter what. Like, this way I die to shock, and the other way I only die to a lightning strike, but... He's already shown a single shock, and... Well, I have the sacred creature anyway. What's plus? Yeah, what am I getting? Is this an instant? No, it's a sorcery. So I'd have to cast River's Rebuke now. And then he casts Demanding Dragon and I die. Okay, well. That's unfortunate. You know what? I think my deck rank is too high because of Karn. And this, this is very interesting, right? I, I said this might actually matter. I think I need to take Karn out. Oh, what? Yeah, sure. I want another one of those. I didn't know I didn't have another. Let's see. Is there anything else that I want to put in as a second one? Yeah, just against aggro. Let's throw another one of these in. What do you mean? Oh. What? I got rid of two cards. And I, oh, I... Um... Excuse me, what? Well, that's annoying. I don't understand what's wrong with that. Anyway, while I try and troubleshoot, <laughs> um, while I have my teeth out and I can't speak, I'm going to be playing uh, Merchants, or a similar list to Merchants, uh, Gutter Snipe deck. Uh, I'm also going to, <laughs> I'm going to make a deck, uh, on, like on camera, as it were, um, and then play that deck from scratch, no looking at... Uh, like any lists or anything, no no pre uh, premeditated idea. I'm just literally going to play the game and see what I'm able to do. Um, it's going to be the entire thing, so it's probably going to be a long video, but it's uh, probably going to be an odd video. Why is this? Why was this not letting me do this? Of course, it's why. That's hilarious. I feel I feel a little dumb, but I think the Karns made our our deck strength too high, so we have to take it down by removing Karn, <laughs> which which sounds ridiculous. But like, if if that's how they're grading things, right? Like that deck was too strong for me, going up against the Tree Branch. Um, is that is that everything that I wanted to talk about? We talked about the the order of decks that I'm going to play. Oh, cool. That's another good hand. And we're going first again. Cool. So we have a lot of ramp. We just need a lot of card draw now. Scorpion. Pono Mold again again. So yeah, it'll be Angels, then Sacrifice, then Moldrotha. Scratch it on top. Um, we're going to add what's in the rotation to the descriptions. We're going to be playing Gutter Snipe and a, a random deck. Going up against the artifact deck, it looks like. Who's laughing now? No, no, no one's laughing. So now I want to draw the, uh, the that that two mana Nissa card so I can destroy their stuff. Um, let's see. Oh, uh, a lot of stuff on the forums is talking about uh, one, maybe not. Oh, my opponent's playing life gain. Oh, this is this is the deck that runs like the um. What's the what's the name of the card? Um, a Johnny's Pride Mate, I think. 
The one that gets swole for gaining life? Okay. Sure, sure. I can play any of my bombs, just let me draw them. <laughs> um... Okay. Play a lands. I think I can kick this, can't I? Kicker is two? Oh yeah, I can absolutely kick that. Can I play this and kick it? One, two, three. One, two, three, four. No. So I'll just cast this kicked. Also, we'll get stuff out of my deck. This is why we're running card draw. <laughs> this right here. Oh, I did not know it would do that. Okay. I should I should read the cards. <laughs> we have we have no cards in hand. A ton of lands though. We can cast anything. We just need card draw. <laughs> okay. And we do have a nice buffer against his uh his cards. So, I'm finally going to be able to get to the, th the crap I'm talking about. I'm a little delirious. I'm recording later than I would like to. Um, we I just got home late. Tatiova is a fantastic draw here. Um, you could have argued that like I didn't need to play all of my lands when I played them, but uh, Tatiova's probably going to get Vraska's. Luckily, uh, he can't he can't respond to me playing a land. He can respond to the trigger. So yeah, he, she's getting Vraska's, which is uh, unfortunate. Um, or not. Oh, cool. All right, well. Okay, now I think there's going to press this. Okay. Um, I mean, that, that's unfortunate. Especially that we drew another land instead of anything we could have played. Um, when your opponent... When your opponent has looked at your hand, right? For them, they get to keep seeing what is in their hand. But for you, you don't know what they've seen. So, a lot of people want to make sure that's something that can happen. Um, I mean, there are other hand indicators for things... So I don't think it'd be too hard to have that. Lyra is a problem. Oh, we don't have removal in this deck. Guys, I think I'm a bad player. I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna let you guys know. I'm a terrible deck builder. I'm an okay player, but I'm a bad deck builder. Um, I don't think we want to cast this. Like it get, it gets two more lands out of our deck, but. But I think it's just better if we have Tatiel before it. I mean, we're going to start getting beat down a little. Yeah, this is bad. I have to decide if I value the thinning my, my land of two decks or the Tatiova, and I think I value the Tatiova power here. I think I might have built this deck fundamentally wrong. I don't I don't know how to play ramp decks. Or I don't know how to build ramp decks. So I'm gonna give this deck another shake. <laughs> if someone has a good list <laughs> that they would like to send me, I would be more than willing to play it during one of my days of delirium. I think I, I think I have like three minimum days of uh, not being able to talk. So, oh, Tatiova. Yes, this is exactly why I left those lands. Okay. So we can do this, kicked. We're going to draw two cards, gain two life. Heck yeah. I didn't help. I can I can counter something. <laughs> Alright, I get to draw another card. Cool. Okay, I can I can still counter something. And I, I probably have to... No, no, I'm dead. Blah! <laughs> oh, darn. Oh, well. <laughs> All right, I'm I'm going to give this deck another shot. Someone better at building decks than me. Put together a list that doesn't run too many 
artifacts and enchantments. Er, artifact, oh my gosh. It's apparently very late. <laughs> that doesn't run too many mythics and rares. And then hit me up with the deck list, and I will play it. <laughs> I I play better. I mean, I'm, I'm still dead, but, you know. I, I, I play better than I build, 100%. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. Oops. Man, I am... I am a mess. <laughs> Dude, I had a long day. I woke up at, like, 7, and I, I just got home, like... I don't know, 10, 20 minutes ago? It's, like, 11 now, so... <laughs> or, uh, as I like to say, uh... 2300. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll play another one. I should. I think I am going to drop this. Uh, I think I do want the spring to mind. Let's only do one broken bond, and let's let's put in blink of an eye. Can I? Can I go over here? Thank you. Thank you. All right, that's not true removal. It's pseudo removal, and it draws a card. So let's let's do that. Let's let's see if that works. Okay. Oh man, I'm bad. Going up against Sappers. Sappers the Ajani. And opponent is going first. They kept pretty hastily. Man, shout out, to, shout out to these constant Llanowar Elf starts. I'm, I'm, I'm keeping it. Um, we're not going to have double blue for Disallow immediately. Um, but we can grow from the ashes on turn two to get an island. Opponent is on white-black, probably mid-range, based on uh, the information I have here. Oh, we got an island. Cool, cool. Um... A part of me actually thinks that I want to hold up for Supreme Will here. Because, like, I don't get anything out of ramping just yet. Yeah, I think I think I want to hold up for Supreme Will. Sure, they can't do anything. They're going to attack me for two. I can't block, which is fine. Oh, no, my opponent could kill my Llanowar Elves here. Um... And then I could, you know... Oh, wait, what am I talking about? If they try to kill it, I just can't, I just counter it. I am glad that I did what I did. I am very glad that I did what I did. Uh, unfortunately, that does mean that we're not going to have a Nissa on this turn, but that's fine. Um, so if I tap... Hmm. No, uh, well, the problem is... The problem is I can't disallow... Even if I grow from the ashes, I'm only going to be getting one. So, so I don't know. It, it's unfortunate, right? If I if I if I ashed ashes last turn, I would have had another island. I would have been able to play Nissa. She would have necessarily been able to do anything for me, except have like a good walker on the board. Um, but I would also have disallow mana up. Um. I think I'm fine just ending turn and getting using Glimmer of Genius. Yeah, I think that's fine. Uh, I'm not entirely sure. Maybe, maybe I was just thinking about this wrong. Maybe it's I shouldn't be thinking about it as like a ramp deck, but like a control deck that wants to get a lot of land drops in a burst. Maybe that's what I'm supposed to be doing. I do hope my opponent doesn't have anything too crazy sure that's fine so it doesn't seem like this is like a white black uh knight's deck or anything i, I think it's just kind of a, a white black mid-range which is cool we're seeing different decks you're trying to kill my guy i would rather have the field of ruin
Interesting, okay. So I want to guarantee that we can have uh, Tatiova next turn. I can't disallow anyway. So I'm just going to Glimmer here. Just to make sure that we would draw. Okay, so I think... I think I'm just going to do this. And essentially, it... I, I want to try and guarantee us having a land. That's that's annoying. <laughs> I'm making awful mistakes. Don't hate me. I wasn't able to put in the amount of time that I usually put in. <laughs> awesome. Am I gonna? I, am I gonna play it now though? Hilariously, I don't think I do. Like, I think I... I I, I want to say I play the forest and then Nyssa. Oh, so bad. Like, I need to get Tatiova out. But I need to do it in a way that she doesn't, like, just die super easily. Because I want to get value from Grow, to the, grow, uh, grow from the Ashes. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 TikTok. Let's, let's go for it. Let's just YOLO Tatiova. If she dies, she dies. If she dies, I do still have Nissa. so... Oh, right, Nissa can just get her back. Okay, it's fine. It's... Oh, wait, unless she gets exiled. Awkward. Okay, Nissa can get her back. <laughs> So next turn I can play Lanawar uh no, just Nissa, unless I get a untapped lane. Oh, this is so painful. If I get no, sorry. Yeah, I can't even carnage tyrant, jeez. Am I like just dead? I'm not I'm not just dead. Gosh darn, am I so close. So I'm gonna, get, I'm gonna get a blue and a green. This did not go according to plan. I... So, so what I usually do when I'm playing... When I'm making new decks or, or making big changes to decks... I I play several uh, games. Several practice games to make sure the deck like works. I didn't play like any practice games with this deck. Because I did not have time. Because I've been... Scheduling dental appointments. Okay, I'm dead. <laughs> uh, I've been doing a lot of stuff. So, I don't think I gave this deck a fair shake. So, what I'm going to do is... Hopefully, get some uh, some submitted deck lists from you guys. Uh, kind of amalgamate them and then give them, uh, give them a fair shake when... I'm essentially in the <laughs> After after my my surgery, um, and hopefully come back stronger, better than ever. But yeah, <laughs> hope you guys didn't hate this video. <laughs> if you didn't, go ahead and tap that like button, add a subscription to your mana pool, and cast a comment to the comment section down below, telling me uh how I can how I can get good, <laughs> cause that uh, that was not good. <laughs> and until next time, I will be one.